What's going on guys, Arva here and welcome back to the F1 Wheel of Fortune series. This is the series where we spin four different wheels of fortune at the start of each episode and each of those wheels corresponds to a different parameter of an F1 challenge we're going to do today. The first one being the actual challenge itself, the second one being the track we're going to be doing it at, the third one is the driver we're being, and the fourth one is the race distance it will be done over. And I want you guys for each episode to keep commenting below new ideas you have for the challenge wheel. And if I like it enough, it will go onto the wheel for this series. So without further ado, let's spin those wheels. Okay, so the first wheel to spin is the challenge wheel. So that will be the challenge we're going to be doing today. As you can see, the wheel is absolutely ram-packed with challenges now after the first episode. So you guys absolutely went ham in the comments. So uh, keep commenting below any new ideas you have. And if I like them enough, they will be put on this wheel. And you can see your challenge come up one time. So let's click to spin and see what we get. And it is going to be... Uh... Third gear only. Okay, that is going to be very interesting indeed. So that means we can only be in third gear for the entire race um, from the start to the end. So, um, okay then, let's see what the track it's going to be at. Please do not be Monaco, otherwise I will die. Here we go. Click to spin. It's going to be... That's... Uh, which What track is that? That's uh, Austria, Austria, Austria. That will be Austria. So that's not too bad, I don't think. Austria's got quite a lot of third gear to second to fourth gear corners. So I think third gear might suit it quite well. Alright, not too bad. Let's see the driver we're going to be with. Spin away. And the driver today is going to be... Oh, Hamilton. So close to it being Ericsson. That would have been an absolute nightmare. But Hamilton, okay, that's probably good for me. Probably, you guys probably wanted Ericsson. But the wheel decides it. Hamilton is our choice. And finally now, the uh, race distance. Final spin of the wheel. Today's race will be five laps. Okay, five lap race. So that's a five lap race. We're going third gear only in Lewis Hamilton's car around Austria. Let's hit it. Okay, here we go at the Austrian Grand Prix in Lewis Hamilton's Mercedes. Five lap race, five red lights, third gear only. This is going to be very interesting. Up the third gear. There we go. We're going to be stuck in that gear for the entire race. And we're just going to go backwards, really. I can't see anything. I can't see it going any differently to just me going backwards and just finishing the race in last. Because look at the speed. It's breathtaking. It's breathtaking. 125 or 4 miles per hour. Everyone is just going past me. Just, just, just lovely. I didn't really think of this aspect of Austria. I just thought the corners, really. I forgot there were so many long straights and just... Oh, this is just marvellous. The wheel spin's still horrendous in third gear. And then I've got no speed at the front. You know what? Let's try and defend some positions. Try and finish as high as we can. I know it may not be very clean. But otherwise, we are literally just going to finish in last. And then there'll be pretty much no point of the video. So let's try and hold some people up. And stay in 13th as long as we can. Here we go. Just weaving around like an absolute dickhead. I'm going to try and stay in third gear the entire time. And see if we can keep this beautiful 13th place. Because if I just race normally, they're just going to all streak past me at some point. And then I'll just finish last and be going around in last for like the entire race. Um, oh god no, Gutierrez got past. Suttle's got past. Bianchi's got past. They're all going past me now. Was uh, the track is just far too wide? Bianchi's going slow. Kobayashi's trying to make a move. He's trying to make a move on a Mercedes. What is my life become? Here we go. Oh my God, the engine is just probably wrecking itself right now. Nope. 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 No. Nope. Piss off. No. The weaving game is not strong today. Trying to weave around to stop them. I'm down to 18th. Lost the back end. How are the tyres feeling? I'm actually feeling okay at the moment. And uh, Perez. He's going to try and make it. Nope. Nope. This is not working. Defending from the air. They're too quick for me in not third gear. <laughs> Just a cheap cut. Oh, we are now last. We are back off the 20th, but we are going to go basically last eventually. These two cars. That's all that's up. We're going to get lapped at some point, and we're just going to create havoc when they come lap us. Here comes Chilton. Let's try and stay in 21st. No, Chilton. We're going to have some pride. We're going to stay in 21st at least. All right, you're a permanent constant in F1, all right? You're the constant of being in last, all right? Nope, nope, nope. 
still block Chilton. Lovely. Well, I'm going to have to go in reverse, really. But uh, we'll quickly go back to third. Oh, look! Chilton's still stuck. Yes. Mission complete. Ha, ha, ha. Not going to be a last, all right? Chilton's like a constant, all right, in F1. You know when you like, have a science equation and there's like, you know, the spring constant in GCSE. And, you know, they have K as a constant. That's Chilton. Chilton is C. Constant in F1 being last. All right, if F1 was a formula, Chilton is C, the constant, last. Um, so, yeah, we're in 20th place. Let's just um, enjoy the scenery, really. I think that's, that's all we can really do until we get lapped. So here we come through for um, Country File, Austria edition. As you can see, there's some beautiful mountains and trees in the distance up ahead. The crowd goes wild here, and there's a wild Chilton. Chilton, what did I tell you about being constant? Fuck off. Nope. Nope. He spun us round. He couldn't handle being a concert anymore. Right, well, after that amazing bit of action there, uh, the most action Country File is ever going to get, let's continue with Country File Austria. You can see there was a blimp just there up ahead. We can see a whole lot of crowd on the left. Some fields. I think I spot a wild coot in, in the distance there on the right. They're, they're very rare indeed. Um, don't, don't believe what they tell you. I didn't spot a wild coot in Return to Glory online number one. Uh, definitely just spot it here. There's another oh a hot air balloon on the on the, on the front, so uh, they'll obviously be looking down on this beautiful action of the Austrian Grand Prix, and they'll be thinking, what on earth is Lewis Hamilton doing going around in third gear? What a nutter! And then here we can see some artificial gravel on the left. We don't like that here at Country File Austria. Very bad indeed. It's not good for environment. We can see the Red Bull, the actual Red Bull itself here, at the Red Bull ring. See, see some more artificial gravel on the right. That's bad again. Another blimp on the right, and we just saw a glimpse of the bull. I think you can see it. We look backwards, and we lost the car. Absolute tree, and there's some people coming to lap us. Here we go. Some action here on Country File Austria, and Alonso's going past, and we're just, we're just still going around. There's some more mountains on the left. Um, what else is there left to really spot? I mean, there's a marshal over there. Uh, oh god, we may have just taken Masters front wing out, but that's fine. And we come back through to the end, and that is Country File Austria. Thank you very much for watching. I know that was brilliant. Join us next time for Country File Afghanistan, where we're going to watch nothing happen again and we're just being lapped once more how many times can we be lapped and we've broken our front wing Hulkenberg just headed us into war cheers for that mate and uh we're just 21st and just mugging it just mugging it really so i don't really know what the person who i can't remember who commented this below in episode one but i don't think i don't know what they had in mind for this challenge in terms of what they thought it would be Third gear is maybe not the best gear to stick in a circuit with. I know there's another challenge on the wheel, which is eighth gear only. So that might be a bit more actual, like, you know, you can drive a bit because, you know, you'll just be slow on acceleration, but you'll still get up to top speed. This is just, well, this is just shit. This, I'm just going nowhere, really. Just We're just going around looking for flowers. There's no flowers anywhere. I was about to say we're looking at flowers, but looking around, do you see any flowers on the grass? I don't. I think Austria has a serious problem. They need to plant some flowers here. I mean, what is going on here? So, someone clearly did not hire a gardener in the budget for Austria. Um, yeah, we're, get, we're getting lapped by Kobayashi and Maldonado and nearly Perez. Never thought, they probably never thought they were going to lap a Mercedes. Our teammate Rosberg's won. That's been the F1 Wheel of Fortune today. Third gear only. Conclusion, it went shit. That challenge was just horrible and i never want to visit country file austria ever again that is not a program that, that's a program that needs to go on bbc4 the, the the channel that just programs are made for for like 50 year olds when they got nothing to do in the middle of the day never mind it's, people not from the uk won't get that joke but never mind that has been the f1 wheel of fortune today if you did enjoy that if you did enjoy my brilliant country fire skills and do give it a like comment below what you thought keep on commenting below challenges and hopefully there's a better one than third gear only that we got today but if you did enjoy that nonetheless then do give it a like again comment below your challenges what you thought of that one 
Uh, do you think Austria needs to hire a gardener to put some more flowers? I do. I think it's a really serious issue that needs to be dealt with urgently. But uh, yeah, I've been Arifa. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Subscribe if you're new around here for more F1 content just like this. Uh, some of you guys have been wondering on Twitter where career mode was on Monday. There was a lot of issues with uh, YouTube processing, sub boxes. So I've just pushed that back to Friday. It's a good episode, worth waiting for, so that's coming on Friday, guys, if you, if you were wondering about that. But yeah, if you're new around here, subscribe for F1 like this and career mode. I've been out of there again, hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll see you guys next time.